Hey you guys, your girl is back and with another Buff Bunny haul. I am so excited for this collection. This was the Storm Collection launched in January by Buff Bunny. And when I say I am obsessed with nearly every one of these pieces, I truly mean it between the colors, the quality, the fabrics, the fit. It is just a vibe and I love it. So today we'll go through the different pieces that I hauled. Um, and I picked up and give a little bit of a review, show some colors, um, and maybe you guys will go and get yourself some Buff Bunny as well. So with that, let's get started with the pieces that I'm currently wearing. Buff Bunny came out with a new line, a new fabric called the Cloud fabric which is in all of her joggers and I know all the influencers out there are saying this is the stretchiest softest jogger fabric you probably will ever try on. I'm gonna join that crew and say the same thing because it truly is. It's triple brushed on the inside and double brushed on the outside. It has nice embroidered detailing on the cuffs. It is very soft and stretchy. So for size references, my body shape is a bit different, um, where I fluctuate between sizes with athletic wear. In this set, I'm wearing a medium on the bottoms, a large in the bolero, and a large in the candy wrap. And this is all in the color Mojave Mint. And I think it is just the perfect color for spring. Now for the pants, I'm usually a size 6, size 8 in jeans, and the mediums definitely have some room, but what I didn't want was for some very comfy, soft, cozy loungewear and have it be too tight. Same thing with the bolero. I usually like a medium or like a large in the tops. I went with a large because I did want that little like oversized fit in the back and it to be a little bit more relaxed. Um, and then for the candy wrap, I always consistently am a large in the candy wrap because I feel like they run a bit small. I do have a larger chest, so it just makes me feel supported. And I love this bra. This is one of the favorite, my favorite bras that they launched. It gives me all the support and, and coverage that I need while still looking fun, sexy, and interesting. So here is the set. Um, I also, so this is a two for one, I do have, and they just relaunched, the six inch Legacy Short. And I have never tried their Legacy shorts before. I've always been a Rosa girl. I love that crossband waist. Um, but when I saw the six inch shorts, I knew I had to try them. So here's the six inch shorts, so much longer. If you guys remember um, public school days doing the fingertip test, these pass the fingertip test. But what's nice about it is you can hike them up just a little bit and they show a little bit more skin and they're cute. So these are perfect for me. For my body type, I'm looking in the mirror. Um, I love how these fit because I have extra loose skin on the inner parts of my thighs from losing weight. So I think these are going to be a staple in my spring and summer wardrobe for the gym. And I'm really hoping that they come out with more colors in this um, hemline because it is just everything that your girl needed. Okay. Let's talk these shorts for a second. Um, so as you guys know, I will always be 100% transparent and honest with you. And I love the Rosa shorts by Buff Bunny. They've got the crossed waist. They're nice. They're a nice fabric. I don't know if this is a different fabric. I need to look that up. Um, or if it's the waist, if it's the color, but these are just not it. I am ret going to return these. Um, I feel like they're slightly sheer, like I can see my underwear, my nude underwear through these shorts. Um, and the fit, I just don't see myself gravitating towards these. I had high expectations because I love me like a sunshine yellow moment. I'm definitely keeping the um, candy wrap, but the shorts just need to go back. So these are legacy four inch shorts. I'm going to try them on in Mojave Mint to see if I have the same fit issue with those. Um, and let you guys know. But one thing too here, so for the candy wrap bra, I am a team no pad girl. <laughs> I take out all the pads of my sports bras. I just don't think they do anything for me. Um, and then I always get like this, like as you can see, sometimes the pads are just not 
in the right condition. Like these are like all wrinkly and warped. I pulled out, before I put on my green one for you guys, I pulled out the Mojave Mint. It is the same color as your bra, which is really nice, but I feel like they're not the best quality. I don't know what happened to the cups, but they're just like bumpy and lumpy and just not cute. So I always pull mine out. The risk of pulling yours out is you can show some things that, you know, some women might not want to show. I personally don't care. We're in the gym to work out. Who cares? Um, so that's my preference. So I am going to keep, of course, this candy wrap bra. I love the color. Again, I had so many high hopes for this. I actually grabbed the same color in the joggers and in the hoodie. So this will be a cute little sunshine moment. I can try this on for you guys too in just a second. All right, guys, this is everything. I am obsessed with this color. I feel like when I put this on, I instantly got happy. I can't wait to wear this to the gym on a day. It's cloudy outside. It's gloomy. I can bring some sunshine to the shop. So I am obsessed. This time I am wearing the cloud hoodie versus the bolero. I did once again get it in a size large because I heard that the waistband on this, it's not cropped by any means, but it is a little bit short. Um, and it, I forgot what Heidi called it, but essentially it matches or overlays with your jogger waistband. So it doesn't come past it. It doesn't come higher. It just kind of matches it. Um, so I did once again, get a size large. I think the fit is perfect for me. Um, and I am just overall obsessed with this look. And I'm so glad I love how this fits because I did pick this up in a green hoodie. Um, I picked it up in the black set and then I picked it up in off white. Now, Let's talk about the off-white for a second. <laughs> when Heidi and some athletes were trying these on and were showcasing the off-white, it looked, I don't know, different on camera. When I got this in person, I think it is very close to my skin tone. So I run the risk of looking odd. I haven't tried this on yet, so that's my next move. Let's try this on and see how this fits. And here's a nice color comparison between the yellow and the off-white. Um, let's give it a try. Let's see how it looks. Uh, and maybe you guys can help me decide, do we keep or do we return? Okay guys, so here is the off-white in the Cloud Jogger and the Cloud Bolero. What do you think? Do we like it? Is it cute? Let's weigh in. Should I keep or should I return? Yeah? That's what you said? Okay. Well, I'm going to say hey, I'm going to keep this piece. Um, I, I don't know if it's because I layered it with the yellow. It's making it look more tan with what I hoped it would be. Um, it's probably just an illusion. And I'm here for it. I think it's cute. It doesn't entirely match my skin tone, right? We're slightly off. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and keep this. I think this could be a vibe even with like a black bra and some black shorts. So let's go ahead and keep this. And if you guys are ever debating between getting a piece, I always recommend just getting it. Buff Bunny's return process is pretty easy um, and they work really fast to get you either an exchange in a different size or a different color or help you return and get your refund. So I love this. Let's go on to our next pieces. Okay guys, so here's our next fit. These are the four inch legacy short in the Mojave mint color. And I don't know if it's because the yellow is more sheer than the green, but I don't mind these as much. Again, I'm not using the word love or like these excite me. So I am likely to return these because they're just not, they're just not doing it for me. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and return these, but what is doing it for me is this Wonderless sports bra. So I am obsessed. My go-to, I don't have to think about it, I just grab and go sports bra, is the Buff Bunny Geo sports bra, which is pretty much identical to this. I don't really know the significant differences other than the design between this bra and the Geo because they both have that cool strappy back with the hooks for adjustment. I love this bra. It has a higher neckline, so when you're doing rows or deadlifts and you're leaning over, you're not spilling out. Same thing with the sides. I get great side coverage. It's an amazing bra. This is their new Wonderlust fabric. 
And I don't know if you guys can tell, but it literally glows. So the idea is that someone can wear this running in the dark or at night and it reflects off of them and it keeps them safe. Love this piece. I'm definitely keeping it. Okay guys, the last try on for our haul today is the tea leaf color in our legacy leggings. These are a classic go-to. They're so soft and buttery. Love them. I love this brand new color. And I also picked up the brand new Infinity Sports Bra. This is one of their new high compression support sports bras. I picked it up in a size large because it was supposed to be more compressive. The way this fits is like a, in between a rosa and a bloom bra. I love it. I think this is going to be a go-to. I'm really hoping that they launch this in more colors because of the support that it gives and I just feel secure. And that wraps up our Buff Bunny haul and try on. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you like this type of content, go ahead and give my video a thumbs up. Also let me know if you grabbed yourself any of these items from the haul in the comments below, or maybe I sparked you guys to go back to the website and snag you a few extra pieces as well. So thanks for watching and I will see you guys very soon.